is the next stop, 13th ranked Stamford and Cisco battle to remain at the top of this district. Just under six minutes to go in the game. I mean, in the first, Cannon Orsage throws it deep. Kelton Desmond on the catch. That uh, sets up the next play. Orsay spins looking Julius Prophet in the end zone. Touchdown. Don't mind the flag. Lobos take a 7-0 lead. The Stanford answers right back, though. Christian Duran calls his own number. Heads to the outside. He's taken down with the quarterback keeper to score uh, to tie the game up. And Stanford picks up the victory. 28-13. Stanford now 7-0 on the season, 3-0 in district. Cisco falls to 3-1 with the loss in district play. Now we're going to get in the way back. Oh, yeah, I got one more score for you here. Anson over Alney. Uh, Anson takes it by the final score of 28-12. They're at home tonight. In the Wayback Machine we go now. The Holly Bearcats welcoming to uh, cold and determined winters, blizzards to town. Breckenridge out in front, 8 0. Keegan Abels airs it out. Deontay Ramon with the catch. He's got it. It is 14 0. Blizzards bringing it right back at you. Alejandro Garcia with the carry around the right side. His touchdown makes it a 14 6 game, but Bearcats keep coming at you. Abel's to Ramon again. Ramon sitting down in the end zone this time. Let you know he made the catch. Winners put up a fight early, but Holly was able to drive out the cold and pull away for a 48-12 victory in this game. Here are the rest of the scores from this uh, from Class 2A Division 1. Coleman and Hamilton. Coleman wins it 29 to 22 to improve to three and one in district play. Toller Rattlers over the DeLeon Bearcats. That final score is 44 to eight. That's DeLeon's first loss in district play. The Bangs Dragons hosting San Saba and Bangs picks up their first win in district play. They are now one and three with a 41 to 38 victory over the Armadillas.